Uh, certainly is a, it is a wonderful feeling because we are concluding now uh, from my perspective a six hour seven hour work and uh, we are ready to go and therefore there is emotion there is tension but uh, we also feel quite good because we believe that we did all the work and the job with which uh, we should have done you've been working for it's not the end of it. well it is the completion for most of the project people but is the beginning for the science because now after launch we will go through a period of four months of, um, uh, of commissioning where we switch on the spacecraft, we switch on the telescope, we check that everything is in order and then in around April, end of April, the nominal operation will start and therefore the science. So we can say that uh, the spacecraft is born today or now at the launch and now it starts uh, his uh, own life. Yes, I feel uh, actually I'm very proud to be part of uh, a project which was that long, which was really a good uh, example of European cooperation because there were more than 50 companies participating to the uh, construction of the spacecraft, representing 15 European countries, so it's really a real an example of the Europe that can work together. This is the great moment for, uh, for everyone. Uh, it's a moment that everyone is present, the engineering, engineering part who are preparing the satellite, but also the scientists are looking, because for scientists this is the beginning, for the engineers this is the little bit the end of the project. And at the background we can see uh, practice of the countdown just before the launch, so that everyone is ready to go. It's, it's in the future. For every professional astronomer, there is no need to explain how fundamental Gaia is. Everyone knows that when you get the distances to stars, it's the basic of all the rest of the astronomy. And everyone is looking forward to get this data in hands.